I am salivating for this to happen. It's like my ultimate goal in this house is to kick Will out of All Stars. That Danielle from season three is back. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I'm scared. No, no, you don't need nothing to worry about. They need to recognize. Sometimes people who scumbag need to be scumbagged. I got something wicked coming. Neil Patrick Harris. Best show on television. How I Met Your Mother. Neil Patrick Harris, what up? Oh, Neil Patrick Harris. Oh. <laughs> this is unbelievable. I got to go into the Big Brother house today. Who can say that? I'm a huge fan of the show, All Stars, best season ever. Holy crap, I'm in the Big Brother house. All right. Ho, 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 rise and shine, everybody. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, oh my God. ho, Merry Christmas, everybody. What's up? How are you, How are you sir? Oh, no. I'm your secret Santa for today. No There's a big exciting thing oh, happening for you. What's up? Hi, How are you? Merry Christmas. To you as well. I was lying in bed, and as usual, I was having a dream about hanging out with Neil Patrick Harris. And uh, it was no longer a dream. I was really hanging out with Neil Patrick Harris. You're a big fan of this show. I am a huge fan of your show. So I hear <laughs> boss. Way, way into it. Well, we won Christmas in August in our luxury slash food competition. If we go on slot for a day, will there be Christmas in August? Yeah! yeah! Will was so happy because all he ever wanted for Christmas was Neil Patrick Harris. I feel like I've won some sort of contest. Oh. Like, Can we have security from Neil Patrick Harris? He's kind, of a, he's kind of a stalker. Does the table keep getting smaller? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Is How many more food? days are left? Do you know? 24. 24 more days? Uh -huh. Why don't we get Neil some slop? <laughs> Wow, that's all kind of nasty. <laughs> you can't imagine what, how, what a big deal this is for us because it's been, has it been 60 days? I don't like, know It's been what day 60 it is. days since we've seen other people. And um, I'm we really... thrilled to be the other person. Doc had a really good Christmas present and um, he was able to share it with us all and that was, that was a great gift. So this is for you, boss. You want to put it on in here? Yeah. It's a whole Santa suit. So cool. Yeah. Come on, Santa, it's time for Let's Christmas. Let's go! Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. Yeah. These are all directly from me. You're welcome. Oh, oh cool, buggy. The house guests got lots of clothes, which apparently they desperately needed. Because if I see Mike Boogie wear a Dolce shirt one more time on the show, really. Oh, oh, this is so me. George is nice, really funny. He's a little, um, simple. Ah, they got a cool star on him, too. <laughs> oh, awesome. <laughs> Power broadcast. Janelle was nice. much more beautiful in person. She has sort of uh, radiance about her. This is my favorite underwear brand. This is so weird. <laughs> oh, it's tight. Oh, nice. Nintendo. Made my day. We've been here, we're looking at the same people every day, and to have Neil Patrick Harris in the Big Brother house. It was so nice. It's one of the best times here this season. All right, guys. I don't want you to go. I have to go now. How I met you. First the trampoline, and now Neil Patrick Harris. What's next? I'm going to win the show? That was awesome.
Well, I'll tell you one. Um, I'm working outside, and there's a storm comes up real quick. Well, I'm there in the garage, and it just, there was a pole, and I was hanging onto this pole and cord and everything. Lightning hits the pole. <laughs> what? And I'm hanging onto the pole. Okay? Uh, it was just a bolt of lightning, and it just cracked, and all I care was to crack. No way. The lightning comes down the pole, the thing that I'm hanging on to. <laughs> I get knocked out. And I'm Chicken just... George, are you saying you've been struck by lightning? <laughs> yeah, I was struck by lightning. Isn't that the kind of story that you would want to mention, like when you first meet someone? Like, that's kind of a life altering event. And it also explains his unique behavior. I wake up and I'm like, honestly, I'm like smoking. And they go, well, you could have all these side effects. Nah, nothing was ever the matter with me. How have you, we been here 60 days and you haven't told this story yet? You've been struck by lightning? Well, it was a long time ago, but yeah. I was the odds by lightning. Are... Wow. Now, important question. Did you have any superpowers afterwards? No. Well, come on, Doc. I would have showed that by now. <laughs> Good point. Chicken George is one of five people in the way of me winning all the marbles here. And if you've already been struck by lightning in life, is it really possible you're going to win a game show of this magnitude? I don't think so, because lightning doesn't strike twice, people. It doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing, Will? In an ideal world, I'd like to get rid of Danielle this week. I'm afraid she's coming after me very quickly, and there's not a lot I can do about it. If I can get Janelle off the block via the POV, maybe I can get Danielle put up in her place. We could send Danielle packing. I know. Everything I have done has been working hard. I know, but what if Danielle wins it? That's terrible. Don't let her win it. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. You really think you guys can do Get away from me. No. I don't want to. I have no one to talk to. Too bad. You'll be fine. Oh. Well. This is what you have to say, Erica. You can't beat Janelle in the finals, but you can't beat Danielle either. We've got to strike fast because otherwise you're going to be in the finals with Danielle and she's going to beat you. This is a critical week for Chilltown. We have to make the perfect decision or one of us will be leaving next week. If I win POV, I can pull Janelle off. She'll be safe and I'll be safe. I'm gonna drop the Danielle thing tonight and then we'll see what happens with the POV. The thing is, if you win it or I win it or Janelle wins it, we can go to Erica and say, look, Erica, put Danielle up, we'll send Danielle out. Yeah, exactly. You or Will have to get HOH next week and put Daniel up. Right. There's no doubt about it. The two of them have to go. But you have to be prepared to maybe have Daniel go this week. You know? Wow. Because if Danielle's not against anybody else, but she can join the finals, she'll win. I think she needs to go. Wow. Wait, you really want me to pee over here? I mean, and you really want me to put her up like that? Yeah. So I find out that you're really I'm gonna kick your ass. Why have you said that two nights in a row? <laughs> <laughs> you're scaring me. We are all going to play for the power Yay! veto. I'm cool with that. But we're going to play tonight's game one at a time. Now we all have to go to separate rooms and Big Brother will call us the yard. All right. Big Brother puts the six of us in six different rooms, locked down. We can't see or hear each other. Each person goes out individually. I was first. In terms of tonight's veto competition, we'd like Janelle to win it so she could remove herself. The worst case scenario.